Hi friends, today I have taken a problem from the topic permutations and combinations. The question is, a box contains 3 white bars, 4 black bars, 5 red bars. In how many ways 5 bars can be drawn from the box if at least one white ball is to be included in the draw? Question is very simple. There are totally 3 varieties of balls that is white, black and red and white color 3 balls are there, black color 4 balls and red color 5 balls are there. From them we need to draw 5 balls totally. In that there should be at least one white ball. Okay. Now we need to find out in how many ways we can draw 5 balls in such a way that there is at least one white ball in the draw. Okay. First of all let me give a, a formula which is most frequently used in permutations and combinations. Number of ways R items can be selected from N items is NCR. Okay, C is the combination. Okay, number of ways R items can be selected from N items is NCR. Okay, now let me explain my statement. There they have given at least one white ball. Okay, at least one white ball means it can be one or more than one. The maximum number of white bars available is 3. So it can be 1, 2 or 3 white bars. Okay. In the draw we can get 1, 2 or 3 white bars. Okay. Now let us see how many bars are there. White bars, 3 bars are there. Black 4, red 5. See from white we need to draw at least one white ball. And the rest of the bars can be drawn from the available 9 bars. It can be only black, it can be only red or a combination of both red and black. Okay. There, here we come across three crosses. One is we can draw only one white ball. Other one we can draw only two white bars, only three white bars. And third case. Okay. So consider case one. In case one, we will draw three white balls. White balls, total number of white balls is three. In that we need to draw only one. That means out of 3 we are drawing 1 so 3 c1 and the rest of the bars 4 that is totally 5 bars we need to draw 1 we have drawn the white ball so rest of the 4 bars can be drawn from the remaining 9 bars so 9 c4 we need to multiply both of this 3 c1 value is 3 and 9 c4 value is in the numerator just 9 write 9 into 8 into 7 into 6 and there below you can see 4 no so you need to write 4 values, product of 4 values, 9 into 8 into 7 into 6. And in the denominator, you write the 4 factorial, 4 into 3 into 1. Okay. 3 into this value is 126. So 3 into 126 is 378. That means in 378 ways, we can draw one white ball and four white, four other balls from the 9 bars okay that means totally 5 bars we can draw here so that means in 370 ways 378 ways we can draw at least only one white ball and rest of the other bars totally 5 bars okay in case 2 that is there are total we'll draw two white balls and the rest of the balls from the other 9 bars okay 3c2 means among 3 white bars we are drawing 2 white bars ok 9c3 means we are drawing 3, 3 bars from the available 9 bars ok 3c2 value is 3 into 2 by 2 into 1 9c3 value is 9 into 8 into 7 by 3 into 2 into 1 this value is 3 and this value is 84 when you multiply 3 into 84 you will get 252 ways so in 252 ways we can draw 2 white bars and three other bars from the given bars okay another one is case three here we need to draw three white bars okay so from three white bars we need to draw three white bars that is 3c3 already we draw three white bars now remaining is two white bars because totally five white bars mm. sorry totally five balls so 9c2 3c3 gives value one and 9c2 gives value 36 so in 36 ways we can draw 3 white bars and 2 other bars from the given bars 
so 378 252 and 36 are the ways in which we can draw at least one white ball and in the draw of five balls okay now total number of ways in which five balls can be drawn in such a way that there is at least one white ball is sum of these values 378 plus 252 plus 36 that is triple six 666 thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel my app thank you